Hospitality Science at Malavis College. So today we will learn about the different types of equipments that is manual cleaning equipment and mechanical cleaning equipment. So first we will discuss about manual cleaning equipment. So manual cleaning equipments which help in the cleaning process by directly using manual energy of the employees. So the common manual cleaning equipment are brooms, brushes, mops, container, clothes. So first we will discuss about brooms. So brooms consist of long bristles gathered together and inserted into a handle. Bristles may be made of brass, cotton, or coconut, corn, fiber, etc. So types of brooms. So there are different types of brooms that is soft bristle brooms, hard bristle brooms and wall brooms. So soft bristle brooms are made from corn fiber or grass and are used for smooth surfaces. So hard bristle brooms are made from coconut fiber and they are used in rough surfaces especially outdoor. These hard brooms are used outdoor. Wall brooms, so the, uh, these are used to remove the cobwebs and they have a soft head and it has a very long handle. So they are used to remove the cobweb that is wall brooms. So brushes are designed to remove dust and dirt from surfaces. So there are different types of brushes that is hard brush, soft brush and scrubbing brush. So hard brush have the bristles that are stiff and well spaced out. They are usually suitable for the removal of heavy soil from the rough surfaces. So they are used outdoors. So next is soft brushes. Soft, soft brush have, have a flexible bristles and which are close together. So soft brushes are usually used in the smooth surfaces for uh, cleaning the carpet or uh, uh, cleaning the carpet or furniture. Next is scrubbing brushes. So scrubbing brushes have a very short hard bristles designed for removing the stains from the surface where it is difficult for the scrubbing machine to remove. So these are the different types of brushes. So next mops. So two different types of mops that is dry mop and wet mop. So dry mop is also called as control dust, uh, dust control mop. So these are used to remove the dust from floor. So which will have a metal frame attached to the mop. So dry mop you can see in the malls or hospitals. So I have to display the picture. Next is, uh, wet, uh, next is wet mop. Next is wet mop. So wet, wet mops are used uh, with the help of the bucket. So for the removal of dirt. So wet mops can be made from cotton or sponge or any other fiber. So wet mop should have been capable for absorbing the water. So they should, uh, the wet mop should be absor water absorbent. Next, uh, next we will see clothes. Various clothes are used dry and wet cleaning. So the different types of clothes are duster, floor cloths, glass cloths, cotton rug, bucket cloth. So first we will see duster. So as you all know why the duster is being used. Duster is being used for dusting and buffing purposes. Next is floor cloths. So these are knitted cloths which are bigger and very thick and are used for cleaning the floors. Next is glass cloths. So glass cloths are very soft which is used in glass cleaning, uh, glass cleaning purpose. Next is cotton rugs. So cotton rug is also called as cotton base. So cotton rugs are made from the condemned or discarded linen. So uh, the, uh, cotton rugs or cotton base is used for polishing of brass or silverware. Next is bucket cloth. So uh, it is a very thick fabric. Uh, it is placed under the bucket to prevent the water marks. So that is bucket cloth. Containers. So there are different types of containers used in housekeeping. That is your buckets, dustpan, dustbin, sani bins, spray bottles, hand caddies. So buckets. So buckets are usually made up of plastic and it helps to collect the water and it is used with the mops for cleaning purposes. Next is dustpan. A dustpan are used with 
brushes and brooms to collect the dust and uh, it is usually made up of plastic. So usually all the dust pans will be made up of plastic. Next is dust bin. So whatever the waste we collect, we put it into the dust bin. Next is sani bins. Sani bins are usually made for, uh, of plastic or metal which has a lid and it is used to throw the sanitary tissues kept in the washroom. So it is, uh, sani bins are usually kept in the washrooms. Next is uh, spray bottles. So spray bottles are used to put the diluted cleaning solution. Next is hand caddies. So hand caddies are, now it might be made from wood, plastic, or metal. So the, uh, the uh, hand caddies have the slots for storing the chemical bottles. So it is very easy to carry. That is known as hand caddies. Next we will see mechanical cleaning equipment. Mechanical cleaning equipment, there are different types. That is vacuum cleaner or suction cleaner, scrubbing machine, uh, shampooing machine, power sweeping or polishing machine. So vacuum cleaner or suction Cleaner. So it is used to remove the dust or the crumbs from surface by suction method. Next is scrubbing machine. So scrubbing machine is used for scrubbing the floor where, are, where there are uh, marks of oil, grease. So scrubbing machine is used. Next shampooing machine. So shampooing machine uh, brushes are made up of nylon. So has it needs to be strong to get through the carpet piles. So in this machine there is a foam generator which produces the foam into a dry form. So when the foam is into dry form the carpet won't get wet. It will get wet but very less. So that is shampooing machine is made, uh, the brushes are made from the nylon. Next is power sweeper, sweeping or box sweeper. So power sweeping or box sweeper so it is an electric sweeper so that has a friction brush so the, that brush will move both this uh, both the ways that is vertical as well as horizontal so it is used to remove the loose soil from the floor or car parking or from the large areas next is polishing machine so as you all know polishing machine is used to give the uh, shine to the floors so it is a, a floor care accessory so that comes with the electricity operated scrubber so that is known as polishing machine thank you so much